Hi, I'm Marcus Fares from Design.com and I'm here with Patrizia Moroso. Yes, we are in a gallery 113, that is the space here in Kortrijk of uh, Army Cans. They asked me to make some special exhibition, a sort of uh, story of 20 years of my work in, in the company with designers. And the, the galleries here are full of prototypes and, yeah. and test, testing out of ideas and yes. materials. And models, like uh, objects that have never been in production after. Unique pieces done for an exhibition. So you can see inside a factory what happens. That is the spirit of the exhibition. So Patricia, let's yeah. take a walk around the exhibition. Yeah. What do you want to show me first? Oh, the first step, yeah. where I, I started okay. making things with my family company. Okay, and when was that? When did you start working for the company? 86. 86. 85 and 86 was the first result in, in, a, in a fair. Okay. The name was Dynamic, Dynamic Collection. 86, the first presentation. 87, the whole collection, around 15, 20 pieces, different pieces. And who was the designer? Massimo Iosaghini, okay. in that time was a very, very young friend of mine. He was first a comic drawer and um, his, his, his drawing were a mixture between Italian futurism and streamline, American streamline. Since years, I was a little fan of Ron. I was following the, move, the English movement, and yeah. I was really absolutely attracted by Tom Dixon, Danny Lane, Ron Arad, and more and more. The first things of Ron was sculptures, beautiful metal sculptures, uh, totally done by himself with hammer and mm. welding. And so, if you see them, they are not perfect. They are models. They are not. They have not a function, only to show me what he wanted. And in the end, the idea was to translate all the uh, important uh, designs that he have done till that moment from a metal version to a poetry version. Mm. And so to have color, to have uh, softness, and to have a cheaper price. To what extent does a company like Morozo have to balance the need to get publicity and to attract attention of the magazines and the need to sell a lot of sofas because... Now, after 20 years that I'm working in the company, I'm very happy to say that what we sell is what I like. The best design that we have, the best objects designed by the best people, like Ron of Patricia, are also the best sellers. That yeah. is a wonderful moment. Do you work through intuition with your designers or do you work through research? Do you decide, okay, well, the trend is this and no, so no, next no, year no, we no need trend. to use these I don't, oof, It's terrible. It's I, I don't believe in trend and I don't believe in too much marketing consultings. I think, I, I, I really believe in the talent of the people, the designers. I am in this side of the, mm. of the balance between the company and the design. I am on the side of the designer and taking care of them mm. because a company is a big structure and can kill them. I'm fighting to save all the ideas. Mm. I never ask exclusivities to no, nobody of, our, of my designers because mm, I think that it's a stupid, very stupid. Uh, uh, the Patricia's research in this uh, antibody in, was to, to try to see if you can do uh, an object in a poetry uh, using only the metal structure and the skin. And so to, to, to make something that is more light and more interesting. If you see all the, 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 the circles in triangles, the waste that you have after the sewing is a part of a petal mm. in the end. And so many of these makes flowers. For me, on this table is a sort of, how to say, big treasure. And uh, these poor things are the starting 
moments of many different projects. So you're kind of sketching in, in three dimensional. Yes. In three yes, dimensions. Yes. Really. Yes. Yeah, yes. Yeah. It's like the metal, the metal models of Ron. That yeah. for him was the most easy way to show me an idea. Yeah. For her is this, that is a manual work, is bended, is done by her with, with, with the, also the, the very rough embroidery. So tell me about your relationship with Patricia. Oh, yeah, yeah, because, we are um, very close friends. Yeah, you're always together <laughs> in Milan at parties. Oh, yes, yes. But she's, she's um. become very well known in, in quite a short space of time in the last few mm -hmm. years and, mm -hmm. and probably best known for the work she does with you. So mm -hmm. tell me about her and how you got together. And, oh. and If you are working with the designer deeply, making what is also done not for, absolutely not for, for a project, not for making objects, not for selling anything, but only for the pleasure to make something together. In the end, the best experience can, can transform also in, a, in the best thing, also investment uh, uh, to, to, to make something new.